Okay, here we are. It's more Shadowgate Hotel. Woohoo! <laughs> so now, finally, let's go around that corner. Okay. Yeah, it might be better to use the map on this one. Oh, uh, okay. Well, okay. Oh. The stones in these walls were probably cut by the hands of enslaved mountain dwarves. Really? <laughs> so we got three doors. Yes. Try to, is there anything else that I need to check before I go to the doors? I don't see anything else to check. Just the three doors. Okay, so let's... I want to look... Do I want to look at them before I go in them? There are doors. So I can't. Okay. So I can just go in them. <laughs> you can, but But it's just going to tell me the doors. Yeah. I tell me it's in the room. Okay. Well, let's start with the right. Well, that's always a plus. <laughs> So I guess let's go. Oops. I don't know why you moved it. You had the finger right over the cursor. I don't know why I did. Oh, wait a second. A shark swims by as if patrolling this calm pool. What's in that calm pool? We're gonna look and we're gonna look and find out. Look. And let's see what we got. The waters of this subterranean lake are as still as a corpse. Speaking now, of corpse. Yeah. There is a corpse there. <laughs> so I could click on him and look, right? Well, it's yeah. Him. Okay. A lime-covered skeleton stares at you through eyeless sockets. Now, He's I'm holding gonna... a bag of Doritos. Can I click on those two, or is it the same thing? They're just Doritos. I don't know why you want to... Not... Well, I don't know if it's going to say the same thing as the... It's a small brass key of Doritos. <laughs> I want to take it. Okay. You can't reach it from here. Swimming the shark-infested pool would be suicidal. <laughs> yeah, I ain't doing that. Says the person who immediately tried to take the skeleton key <laughs> after thought. seeing oh, the shark sorry. and recently talking quite a bit about Jaws and how it scared her. <laughs> It did scare me. <laughs> it still scares me. Okay, so I can't reach him. I have a question. Is this something, a door or something up here? I don't know. Oh, yeah, it is. I see it down the map now. <laughs> All right, well, I can't get that key. At the moment. Right, so I'm going to check out this door. Okay. Nah, I don't want him to hit look. You can just hit B to clear that. Okay. Yeah, you go. Well, I guess let's just start by going in there. Okay. Even though technically you started by doing something else, so you can't use the word start. Water <laughs> cascades over a subterranean cliff into a cool, clean stream. That looks nice. Yeah, it does. <laughs> I probably isn't, but... Okay, I see some stuff here. Hold on. All right, first I see... It looks like a face. Does that look like a face? Excuse me? It looks like a face to me there of some kind. Like where? eyes right here where my hand is. There's two eyes and a face. Wow, you're looking way too deeply at those pixels. Okay. <laughs> Man, I, never before in my life have I seen that as a face. Does it look like a face when I no. play it? <laughs> yes, it does. <laughs> I think guys. it does. <laughs> guys. <laughs> never mind, guys. Don't answer it. I know. It looks like a face with brown I'm hair on top alien, of its head. Sure. Yes, of some creature not of this planet that's a face. You never know. <laughs> Fine. Well, I, I still have something to look at. <laughs> I think it looks like a face. That Carrie will agree with me. <laughs> so she's going to click on it anyway. It is very dark. Well, I just wanted to see. Oh, it is very it dark. <laughs> um, well, these are just all like stuff from the walls that looks like bricks or something. It's amazing. Or stones. She sees a face where there's none. <laughs> and then when she sees the things that are important, she's like, this is nothing. <laughs> okay, hold on. Oh, let's see. This stone is almost perfectly round. This stone is almost <laughs> perfectly round. See, if I'm checking these for nothing, and they're not almost perfectly round, I'm just saying. You know what? 
Yeah, how about you perfectly quick on one? I'm trying. <laughs> this stone <laughs> is almost perfectly round. Oh my goodness. I got this one to check out. She oh, has no one. idea. We talked about it, but she has no idea. This stone is almost So why did I check these round. for nothing? I didn't tell you to look at the rocks. Well, you made fun of because I saw a face. Isn't it weird that uh, those stones are almost perfectly round? Stones don't just do that, do they? Well, I don't know how they got that way. <laughs> how am I supposed to know? Oh, man. Should I take them? <laughs> what would you use them on? I could throw them at somebody. That's one thing you could do. That's all I would use them for. Although you probably throw like a girl. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I, I do, yes. It's not like you have some sort of rock-throwing gun. Oh, my slingshot. <laughs> it's not a slingshot. <laughs> my sling. <laughs> it's a sling without the shot. <laughs> oh, hey, don't make fun of me. Okay, so I'm going to take all these. If I can get on them again. Right. <laughs> Oh, because I was on There we go. Hey, look, they don't just take up one line. They each take up their own line. Why is that? <laughs> because who knows? Oh, come on. Oh. <laughs> That's the worst part. Yeah. And it's the biggest one I couldn't get us. Right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I got the stones for my sling. Um, uh, well, there is a place else. I don't see anything else to check up there. <laughs> Why are you laughing at me? Oh, I should check the water? No. Would you check the water? I don't know. I'm not very thirsty right now. Cold water cascades down a cliff into a small stream. Did I already check the water? No. Okay. It just used some similar words. Oh, that's why I wasn't sure. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I don't see anything else to check. There's rocks. Eh? There's this other room to go to or whatever. And what then, other room to go to? Well, because I came in from the bottom one, right? Sure. Then And the and the uh, map, there's another area to go to. I don't see it. Yeah, you do. It's right here. I'm gonna actually. God, do I want? I should just go there. The way is blocked by a landslide, and even with your might, you cannot clear yourself a path. Guess I'm not going there. Hey, why'd the music go like that? Oh, my my torch. Yep. Hold on. <laughs> we gotta fix that. Okay, so I have to. Okay, so I have to go to the unlit one first? Yep. No. What's your action? Oh, my torch. What's your oh, action? Oh, yeah, I gotta uh, use. Use. And then I want to use this one. Oh, come on. Nope. I try and get to that lit torch, right? Okay. I can't wow, get... you went left to get to the thing to the right. There we go. <laughs> well, you know... Okay. Whew. Man, you don't have that many torches. I know. Somebody would have stopped messing around. Well, tell me where I should go, then I wouldn't have a problem. I don't know. All right. So, enough of you. So now I need to go. Well, I can't go that way because it's blocked. Right. So I was just lost in that. I was thinking about Tropocetic, which is a show that might have officially started by the time this episode comes out, uh, or if not, soon after. And, you know, there's like 178 tropes and games that I look for. Mm -hmm. And I'm just thinking about how one of them is, it's funny because this room makes me think of it. Because for whatever reason, video game developers are always putting in waterfalls as like, oh, look, it's a pretty place. 
but they always put stuff in them. Like there's always a door behind the waterfall or whatever. Oh, okay. Yeah. But this is an RPG, so I'm sure it's not going to matter here. Well, I already checked the water. Yeah. yeah. So, I mean, that's the same thing as what I said. So, sure. Oh, okay. So, I thought you were trying to tell me I missed something. Right? I would never do that. Y- yeah, you would. And you always say it sarcastically, and I never can figure it out. Mm, I don't think so. Uh-huh. I certainly am not trying to egg you into doing something. You are, but I don't know what it is. Um, Sorry, I can't hear you over the sound of the waterfall. I'm not speaking to the waterfall. <laughs> you should. That's why there's no waterfalls left. Is nobody talks to them anymore. Fine. You want to be funny? I'm going to talk to the waterfall. <laughs> oh, I was hoping it was going to have something funny to like <laughs> say back it to you. It didn't. So there. So I wasted that time. Yep, speaking to the waterfall is the same thing as game developers putting things behind waterfalls. Well, how do I know what's behind there? Right? This is a problem I run into all the time. How can I ever tell if something's behind something? I looked already. You looked at the waterfall. Did you look behind the waterfall? Oops, I hit the wrong button. Sorry. <laughs> um... Like up in here? No. Where's behind the waterfall? <laughs> it's how just amazing to me how your brain doesn't think of steps. And here's what I mean. What? You are playing this on my television. Yes. And my television is attached to the wall. Yes. And what do you think might be on the other side of that wall? You don't know, yeah, right? Right. So tell me what's on the other side of my wall. How would you do that? You'd have to get up, go to the door, open it, and look from behind it. You can't open a waterfall. Well, if there were a door there, maybe you could open it. But what's the thing before you open the door that I said? You get up and go to... You reposition yourself to look behind... (laughs) You don't leave, you don't use, you don't speak, you don't hit, you don't close, you don't take. I already did look. I'm not asking you to do look. You, When you click look from here, you're looking at the front of the waterfall. So how would you position yourself to look at the other side of a waterfall? I hit look. Oh my god. I don't really understand. Could you just tell me? No. You just must tell me. Solve this. J- I don't want to. You just if tell me. If you press the look button now and you put it on the waterfall, you're going to get the same words because your guy hasn't moved. How can he see something different if he hasn't moved? I have to move. Oh my God. Yes. And then hit where? I don't know. You were busy looking at the... Do you remember when you were looking at the quote-unquote face? Yes. And what did the text tell you? I don't remember. (laughs) I was wasting people's time. Oh, it was dark. So it means it was registering you were clicking not the thing you think is a face, but something that looks dark. What's the color of dark? If you were to pick a color that represented dark... Black. Okay. And what's near, quote-unquote, the face? Oh, that is, black. Yeah. Hey! Yeah, that was hard. <laughs> the walls in this room are much too close for comfort. Great. The damp walls of this eerie cavern are rough and irregular. Now, I'm betting you didn't see something, so take a look at this room. Okay. Now, exit it. Got a good image of this room in your head? Hold on, I'm looking. Okay. All right, so exit it. All right, I don't know if you saw it that time either. So now go back into that spot. And keep a good eye on that room. Which one? The one I'm going to go the into? The one now? you're going into. Anything weird? Nope, she didn't see it. I see some black thing. Uh-huh. Like, 
I don't know what it is, though. You were supposed to notice that it looked weird as you were entering the room. Oh, okay. Yeah, it looked weird, but, it, you know. No, you, you don't understand. I don't understand. <laughs> All right. Well, what is that thing? Well, I have to check it out. I have to look at it. The rock is quite loose. Do I gotta hit that too? <laughs> I guess so. You hit the rock as hard as you can. The loose rock falls down as if hinged to the wall. There's somebody's bag lunch. <laughs> what is that? Somebody's bag lunch. No, it's not. Bologna sandwich. <laughs> banana. A banana. <laughs> a Hawaiian punch juice box. It's a leather pouch. I think I have one of those. Yeah, this is this is the first coach bag. <laughs> okay, so I wanna open it. The bag one is open. The bag contains three large jewels. Ooh. A blue gem, a red gem, and a USA white gem. I should probably look at those. Let's see if it tells me more about them before I take them. So she looks at the blue gem. It's a dark blue gemstone that is as big as the pommel of a sword. I don't know what a pommel is, so I'm not sure how big that is. But <laughs> yeah, whatever. I knew that wasn't going to help you any. <laughs> it's a fine red ruby. Okay, I know that. And now you can look at the Wittigam. Oh. Its color reminds you of your adventure across the Sea of Blood. Oh. You remember that adventure, right? The Sea of Blood. Yeah. You remember when you played the Sea of Blood? <laughs> no, I don't. Let's look at the white one. It's a white stone of unknown origin. A fine thing to gamble away in a good card game. Oh, really? Well, I'm going to take all three of those. What's funny is I only remember... I think I only remember what one of them does. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. All right. See, now you have learned something important today. Okay. Actually, you've learned two things. You now can go about life knowing to see behind things. You have to maneuver yourself so you could see behind things. Right. At this point in time, most people have learned that. Hey, you don't have to put that in there. <laughs> but now you know the rule in video games of always taking a closer look at waterfalls. Because there's sharks. <laughs> no. I know there wasn't in that one. Yeah. I'm just kidding. So we can move on. Alright, so... Um, and as you're moving out of here, yes. it doesn't appear like we've solved our skeleton key problem, did we? Oh, no. So, it doesn't look like we've got our answer here. So, we're going to have to find some other places we haven't been. Uh, kind of keep going out, right? Do, do, yep. I, I you want to go back to that three-door hallway. The three-door hallway, okay. Yeah, and until you solve this part, you're going to have to sit through that every time. Oh, really? Yeah. Because video games are silly. This one I want to go to, right? Yep, yep. Because I only went to the one door. Okay, so. All right. So there's left and center. Let's do left. Boop, ba -da -da. You're getting better at maneuvering. Oh, thank you. You enter a cold room. The stench of flesh and decay pervades the small chamber. You know what that smells like. <laughs> we don't even have to explain it. You begin to shiver. This room is really cold. Great. Oh, my. There's stuff here. Oh yeah, my. there's stuff here. Well, I'm going to start with the torches. Okay. Because, you know, I'm, I need those. Yep. So she's looking at the torches. Okay. Oh, I don't need to look at them. Nope. That was silly. <laughs> Let's go back to take. 
I was just excited to have more torches, sorry. <laughs> I wasn't even thinking about what I was on. Okay, got that one. Let's take this one. Okay. All right, so now we need to look at, so we got some stuff to look at here. Yeah. So let's start with this thing. Okay. How's that going to look, though? Let's start with this one. It's a small trap door made of polished metal. Hmm. I wonder if I should open it. Oh, I should look at everything first before I open anything. I'm going to do that, okay? Okay. It's a large pedestal with iron trim. Huh. I wow, would... that's actually really not helpful for what that is. I, I, it doesn't even look like whatever they're calling it. <laughs> and then this looks like a door, so... That I'm, is a door. I'm Nothing else to look at? Yeah. Um, no, what is this thing? That's something? I don't know. We'll find out. It's a small hole in the wall, some three inches deep. All right, is that it? Let's see. Well, I'm going to save the door after I open these other things. And I'll, open, I'll look, check out the door. Well, you can't open a pedestal. Oh, that's true. You know, I so guess you I only can... got the door and the trap door to open. Okay. You're still on look. This is the only thing I can actually open. The door is open. Well, and then I guess I go down it. Um, now I can look in there, right? No. I need to look. Okay. Uh, so. You either open the other door or you move into one of them. I'm going to open this one. The door is open. Okay, so. I guess I will move into this one. Okay. Oh the door God. is open. Yeah, I know. It wasn't up far enough. Oh, no. <laughs> Get out of there. That was silly. Oh. Fear grips you as you enter this hot room. Yeah, I don't like it. <laughs> All right. Let's see. So, oh, boy. What is that weird thing at the end of the hall? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Looks like some scary eyes. <laughs> Okay, so let's see here. Well, I do see another torch. Right. Which I'm going to just take my okay, here first. Let's take that torch first. The torch is in hand. Awesome. Okay. Oh! <laughs> Whoosh! Flames suddenly shoot from the dragon's mouth. Dragon flame engulfs your body. You pay for your curiosity with your life. I died. <laughs> I died. It's amazing. You're finding almost all of the deaths. <laughs> Go figure. <laughs> so, when you grab something, Drago gets unhappy. I still got the torch, right? <laughs> no. Oh, because I died. I just loaded oh. you. Oh. Ah. All right. Yeah. Technically, you became the torch for a few. Seconds. I became the torch. Okay. So I don't want to do that. Um. Well, I need to check out some stuff here. Okay. What is this thing it looks like? Oh, I need to look first. Okay, let's check out this first. This spear is some seven feet long. The tip seems to be made of finely forged silver. Hmm, interesting. I'm going to be taking that. Let me see what else I got here. It's a heavy shield. There are only a few dents on it. Is that part of it? Or is that something? That looks no, like that's the skull. I guess I can still check on it. The skull looks like it has been dried and cracked by extreme heat. Oh, huh, interesting. All right. Is this thing part of the shield over here? Nope. No? Okay. It's an ancient gnome warhammer. Oh. This weapon does not show the signs of battle. This seems to be a helmet of the sort commonly worn by hobgoblins. Hobgoblins. This one? Is this going to say the same thing? This one I doubt. Seems to be the skull of some unfortunate individual. Oh. You haven't noticed the thing on the floor so far, have you? The discoloration. Yeah, what is all that stuff? This stuff. This pile of gold is worth a king's ransom. The pieces have been melted together. 
So those are your hints what's at the end of the hallway. Which you already know because it already killed you once. Right, right. So... And then there's a chest over here. Oh, I didn't check that out, did I? This is an extremely heavy iron-bound chest. It is securely locked. Oh, I do have keys, though. You've used both of your keys. Oh, I did use both my keys, didn't I? Ooh. All right. So I'm going to help you out here. Okay. Um, every time you go to take something, the dragon will launch its fire breath. Okay. The only way to survive the iron breath is to have the shield. Your guy will put the shield in front of him in time to block the flames. Every time he blocks the flames, however, the temperature in the room goes up. Do you know of anywhere where it's kind of, you know, cold? In this room? Anywhere. Do you recall anywhere being described as cold? Yeah, where was this? It was the room right outside of this one. So yeah. to get what you need to get from here, the first thing you need to take is the shield. Okay. But you said he'll come after me with this one, though? Or not? He's going to come after you with every one you pick up. That's why you pick up the shield. Okay. So you have something to defend yourself with. Okay. So I'll take this first. Okay. You raise your shield just in time to block the dragon flame. So I like to be abund abundantly cautious here. Okay. So go ahead and just take one more thing. Uh, how about this thing? Because it's... How about this one? Again, flame spews forth. You use the shield for protection. It's getting hot. You don't know how much longer you can stand it. I think you can take three things before being overheated, but I like to be careful and only take two at a time. So you need to move out of this room. I'll go to this one down here. Yep. The room stinks of rotten meat, but it's cold. <laughs> That's right. And okay. so you have cooled down. Okay. Now you can go back in and take two more things. This time I'm gonna take this one. Oh, I'll take this. Oh. So you now have the hammer in hand. You can skip this. Oh, time. I can this skip that. Okay. Same each time. Okay. And I'm gonna take this one. Okay, so now you can leave. Okay. Oh, darn it. Okay. And before you go back in there, go ahead and light your next torch. Oh, okay. Just get low. All right. go back in. We only have to make two more trips. Uh, it's this one, right? Yep. So, we got two skulls, a helmet, and a torch to get. You okay. can't take the chest. Okay. Or the gold. Yep, oh, I didn't have it all on. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I forgot about that if I clicked it. Okay, 
Alright, so one more exit and one more enter. Oh, one more. Yeah, whoa. What are you whoa, doing? I almost. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and I got scared myself there for a second. I was I mean, like having probably fun. Probably would have been fine, but. I don't want to take that chance. Right. Okay, so you already know that smells. Okay, so now I can go back? Yep. Yeah, so you're reading that map a lot better. Am I? Yeah, you okay. used to not. All right, so. Oops. You don't have take, Mark. Yeah, I forget that until I get up there. I was like, okay. Yep. <laughs> I don't remember if you need both skulls or not, but I always do it just, just in, in case. case. Yeah. All right. So get the torch. Nope. Oh, that's right. I was thinking I couldn't get that torch. I don't know why. Because last time it killed you because you that's didn't pick why. up the shield. <laughs> yeah, see, at least you don't have to go through the trial and error the rest of us had to go through. True. Thank you for that. <laughs> All right, now we can leave this place. Okay. We're getting close to the end of this episode, but there's something else that we should probably investigate in the next room. Okay, so I want to go not up that way. I want to go back. No, right? yeah, you're not going towards the dragon. Yeah. You're done in there. Thank goodness. Okay. So I, I didn't go to the down. At the yeah, open. that's true. You didn't do should that. Should I try that one? Or? Sure, why not? A broken fragment of a wooden ladder hangs from the opening. As you go down the trap door, you realize you took a big <laughs> step. The fall is quite <laughs> fatal. Boy! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So, what have we not solved in here? Um... The shark, where the shark was? No, 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 in know. here. Oh. There's no shark oh, in, this in here. Room. Oh, in here. Um, the, whatever that middle light thing is, I don't really know what that is again, you said. Right. Um, but you can't do anything with that. You can't, like, go on it or anything. Right. You can't open it. You can't go on it. You can't open it. You can't go down the stairs because you die. Was, yep. We finished the other room going in there. That's right. the dragon. What's the last object then of importance? Oh, is it this thing up here? Yeah. See, I, I forget because he's so little. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. So it's a small hole in the wall some three inches deep. Okay, so I want to look at that one a little more. No, you just looked oh, at I it. Oh, I just looked at him. Okay, so I want <laughs> to um, open it. Uh, it's a hole. You don't open so you holes. you can't open a hole. Use it. I don't know how you plan on doing that. Well, I don't want to take it. I can't take it. Right. I don't know what to do with it. Um, I already looked at it. Can't open you it. know what's like a hole? In fact, it's so like a hole, it has the word hole in it. But keyhole. Oh, use my one of my keys? No, I'm just just talking. Just thinking about how they're called key holes, which just means hole for a key. Which is weird when you think about it, right? Because, like, there's potholes, but you don't put pots in them. I know, it's a weird clue, guys. I know. What I'm saying is that some holes are, are problems because they're a sign of damage. Some holes are not a problem. They're designed to be holes, and what do you do with them? Well, I'm not going to hit it. <laughs> no, but like a keyhole is not a type of damage, and oh. you put a key in it. But you know your keys have, are, have other keyholes they belong to, not this one. Right. So, what is approximately three inches? Of my stuff that I have? Yeah. Club, no arrow, no sword, no. Sling, no. Key, no torch, no. Scroll, no. A stone? Yeah, no. but what's that gonna do? I don't know. Hammer, spear. My spear's gonna be too big. 
That's everything. It's weird, you said stone. What kind of stones are there? You got rolling I have a ruby. stones. You got gemstones. Oh, just the stone? Up here? No. No. I said what other kind of stones are there? I said rolling stones. Is one example. You have gemstones. See, here's the problem. There's a reason why she's not quite getting this the way we would, guys. It's because she hasn't dealt with elements in video games yet. Elements have colors associated with them, usually. Fire is red, and water is blue, and, and lightning is usually yellow. Stuff like that. Earth is brown or green. What about ice? What color would ice be? Blue. That's one option. So, what are you thinking? I'm going to go to that blue gem. Okay, you're just going to look at it? Oh, yeah, no. I'm going to take it. You already have it. I'm going to use it. On what? On that thing over there by the door. Okay. to fit, but nothing happens. Okay, that didn't help me. Well, I guess we're just out of options, huh? No, there's other gems. Oh. I'm going to try the white one. Okay. The gem fits perfectly in the hole. A small crystal sphere magically appears on the stand. Oh, check that out. <laughs> Okay, so that one I want to look at. This crystal sphere is as cold as ice. Ooh, so and that's... it's willing to sacrifice your love. <laughs> so that was my clue that you were giving me there, I see. All right. Um... Yeah, it's just worth knowing some holes have a purpose and some <laughs> are signs of damage. And so <sighs> that's why you knew you had to do something with it. So I should take it. Yeah. Here is in hand. Now, there's something you should do that you haven't done yet, and I realized you haven't done it, and it's time for you to do it. You should wear that helmet. I should? Yes. So I have to use it. <laughs> What's it? Oh, wait. Is it not going to let you do it? I said I can't. Hang on. Get clear your text. Okay, sorry. Oh, can you just do it with the cloak? With what? The cloak. Oh. <laughs> Where is the cloak? Oh, there it is. Yeah, but you cleared out your use now. Oh. I was afraid I was going to touch something wrong. <laughs> What do you want to use this on? On self. Um, oh, I did it again. Yeah, you keep hitting B for no good reason. No, you can't just use self now. you got to use cloak again. Oh, jeez. Because <laughs> you keep hitting B for some reason. I don't know. Because before I would never hit it. <laughs> okay, self. You try on the cloak and find it very unbecoming. It barely fits over your armor. Oh, great. But you're wearing it now. Okay. At least it's on. <laughs> All right. So, one other thing. Can you take that white gem back or not? Because, I mean, you found it. It's yours. I. Right, what are you doing? You said the gem. The white gem. It's not have... in your inventory. You used it. Oh, well, how do I know if I do it? Well, how do I don't know. What do you mean? <laughs> I'm lost. You lost me big time. You inserted a white gem that you found into a hole in the wall. Yeah, I'll see if I could take it over there. Yeah. Well, I thought it left. I thought it was gone when that thing came. Except it's there on the screen. Oh. Nope, you can't take it. So you have me do that for nothing? 
I didn't know. You have to, you, you were the one willing to just give up what is apparently a diamond. I couldn't get it. Now who's the fool? You. <laughs> so we're going to end this episode here. And we'll come back with another one. Bye.